Hello students. In this video, we will learn something more about many, much, few, less, and several. And after that, we will try to learn uh, a bit of articles. Okay. So students, many denotes number, while much denotes quantity. Okay. As I told you in the previous video. Okay. Uh, students, please watch uh, all the. two parts that i have already uploaded okay clear so that your understanding can be a better one okay few is the opposite of many and less is the opposite of much okay so always remember many denotes number and much denotes quantity several means more than few but less than many okay let's have a look on examples there are many flowers flowers in the garden okay many many people came to see the match okay there is much sugar in the stock okay uh, we have few holidays in the school in school you devote less time to your studies several people paid homage to the departed actor sushant so singh rajput okay now let us discuss one of the important uh, topic that is difference in meaning of few a few the few little, little a little and the little few few is used with a countable noun with a with countable nouns okay it means hardly any means it is used in negative sense okay so it is negative he is a man of few words it means he hardly he speaks mata okay a few a few means some in numbers that means he is not a lonely man he is a okay he has a few friends okay he is not a lonely man okay or if we write another example so we can write uh, um, i shall i shall return i shall return what return uh, your money okay i shall return your money in a few days return your money in a few days so what does this mean it means in a few days means positively he will return the money then the few the few means not many but all of them not many but all of them okay the few friends he had left left him when he became poor means not many but all of them this is sub they left him okay okay the few friends he had or you can say the few books i had on astrology okay okay had been lost okay jitni sari book ho gayi okay the few clear okay next quantify next determiner is little little means little is used with uncountable noun okay with uncountable nouns means nouns that we cannot count okay clear and uh, it means what does it means it means um, not much or hardly any not much or hardly any okay clear or you can say less than requirement less than requirement okay okay uh, and you know less than any requirement it means 
uh, it is negligible in amount in quantity so it is a negative it is negative okay okay students let's have example of it there is little milk okay in the in the house okay so i cannot prepare i can't prepare any tea for you okay clear any tea for you there is little milk in the house little milk little milk that's why i cannot prepare tea for you okay students okay if we talk about another example you can use like a uh, little knowledge uh sorry now we have to talk about a little first and then after we'll write the answer a little what is a little means a little means means some in quantity means it is positive some in quantity thodi matra mein hai okay for example i can prepare i can prepare two cups of tea okay for kyun kar sakte ho kyunki there is a little milk there is a little milk in the house in the house students just try to compare these two sentences here there is little milk it means there was hardly any milk in the house that's why i could not prepare tea and here i can prepare two cups of tea for because there is a little milk in the house means thoda sa hai to do banenge itna hi hai okay or a little money or a little knowledge okay is a dangerous thing is a dangerous thing adhura gyan jo hai na khatam ho gaya pehle no thoda sa gyan hai chalo okay next one is the little okay that means it means uh, not much but all not much but all of that much jitna hai wo sara okay clear for example i spent i spent the you yeah, can say uh, i spent money i had it means jitna tha sara so the little money the little money i had okay i spent the little money i had jitna sara kharch kar diya okay aur you can you can drink the little milk that is in the jug jitna wo sara pee sakte ho to the little milk milk okay clear so these are the use of uses of little a little the little okay clear so this is the end of uh, uh, determiners like uh, that we have already discussed in other videos and in in this video that are possessive we have discussed about possessive okay okay possessives sorry spell got wrong possessives okay we have talked about possessives and uh, even demonstrative 
okay and we have even talked about quantitative quantitative in which uh, we have discussed about the indefinite any some certain okay and definite uh, that is called little much no enough half whole okay clear okay quantitative and uh, numerals and numerals or ordinals okay we have discussed all these okay now we have left only articles so let's try to learn what articles are okay articles for articles uh, if you talk about there are two kinds of articles one is indefinite okay indefinite and another is definite okay if you talk about definite art uh, indefinite articles they are a or n and indefinite articles is the definite article is the okay so article a and n okay are used before countable nouns okay countable nouns okay for countable noun means uh, like countable noun that is singular okay singular noun okay a is used before a word beginning with beginning with a consonant sound okay beginning with a consonant sound so this is the main key point while n is used before words with a vowel sound okay so the basic difference between a or n is the sound difference when you have consonant sound use a when you have vowel sound use n okay clear for example dash pen is to write with so pen a consonant sound beginning with consonant having consonant sound use a okay clear are hen did lay dash egg daily to so egg beginning with consonant which are beginning with vowel and having vowel sound use n okay clear after this difference let us try to learn something more about these indefinite articles so clear so a or n okay they are called are called indefinite articles okay as i told you okay clear so how we will use them this is a big question first in numerals uh sense meaning one the sense kis ke one ke use for example uh, sorry seven days make what week 
what a week okay not a word did he speak so a word okay one clear next to represent a class or category for example this donkey is a donkey is a beast of burden okay animal of burden means bojh uthane kaam aata hai to general sense use a donkey okay okay uh next one is in the vague sense of something certain okay for example for example one night one night dash one night what happened dash thief broke into broke into where in the uh, into his house uske ghar mein kaun aaya thief th sound okay uh, vowels uh, sorry consonant sound what a a thief broke into his house okay let's do another rule the indefinite article is used to generalize the proper noun proper noun is a name of person place okay so for example he is a न्यूटन ओके ही इज अ न्यूटन क्लियर और कालिदास हु इज कालिदास कालिदास इज द क्रेड पॉइंट ओके कालिदास इज अ शेक्सपियर ऑफ इंडिया शेक्सपियर ओके क्लियर टू जनरलाइज अ प्रोपर नाउ मीन्स वैन यू यूज दैम एज टाइटल without of okay next is uh in the sense of the same sense of the same okay same ke sense we use karenge for example two of a trade okay seldom agree सेल्डम अग्री एक ही उसमें हो तो वो कम अग्री होते हैं और ट्रेड ओके और बर्ड्स ऑफ अ फैदर ओके फ्लॉक टूगेदर नेक्स्ट इन देंस ऑफ एवरी एवरी सेंस में यूज करेंगे फॉर एग्जाम्पल rice costs 40 rupee a kilo 40 rupees a kilo ki ek kilo kitne mein aayenge 40 rupees okay clear 40 rupee a kilo okay students and in the sense of some any or a singer last in the sense of any some or singular iske sense mein use karenge kabhi for example i have a regard i have a regard for my uncle clear or uh, there is 
not a man here who can solve this sum. Koi aadmi nahi aisa jo kar de. Okay. You can solve this sum. ऐसा एक भी नहीं जो इसको सम को को सोल्व कर सके यहाँ आएगा सोल्व दिस सम ओके नॉट अ सिंगल मैन वो कैन सोल्व दिस सम ओके बेटा लेट अस लर्न सम मोर यूज ऑफ ए और एन ए इज यूज विद द वर्ड हैविंग अ कॉन्सोनेंट साउंड वेदर द वर्ड बिगिन्स विद वोवल और अ कॉन्सोनेंट स्टूडेंट्स अ वर्ड कैन बिगिन विद अ वोवल or having consonant sound on some time it begins with a consonant having vowel sound so we have to learn both these things and uh, the way we will use article a or n okay consonant with consonant sounds for example uh, what is this man man beginning with consonant having consonant sound use a man okay another is book okay beginning with consonant having consonant sound use a okay clear and same uh, for example um, b a so what a b a okay clear a b a okay yard it means a yard okay clear now vowel with consonant sound like w or y means begins with vowel okay having consonant sound like w or y for example um, for example dash one eyed man one w sound sound is w so use a one eyed man okay clear okay rupee note so what a one rupee note okay because the sound is of w of consonant okay clear uh, for example dash unique building okay so what is a unique building okay and university it means a university means means what will you use a uh, because sound is y okay u sound okay that's why we are use article a okay so where will we use n is it used let me write this for you so that your time can be saved so as i told you earlier n is used before a word beginning with a vowel sound okay here the condition will be vowels with vowel sound okay and sound is also of with with vowel sound for example for example uh i n i okay clear uh, for example um, ox what an ox okay even ink pot so what is this an ink pot okay clear clear so next condition is before words four words uh, beginning that begins yeah beginning with beginning with a silent with a silent vowel sound or silent h kar do
साइलेंट एच फॉर एग्जाम्पल आर एन आर ओके क्लियर एन ऑनेस्ट मैन ओके क्लियर नेक्स्ट कंडीशन इज कॉन्सोनेंट्स विद वोवल साउंड्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल एम ए वॉट इज दिस एन एम ए ओके एस डी ओ ओके वॉट इज एन एस डी ओ ओके एम पी मेम्बर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट एम पी एन एम पी रेवल्यूशन फॉर्म एन एम पी ओके सो दीज आर द यूज ऑफ आर्टिकल ए और एन इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो विल डिस्कस द लास्ट पार्ट दैट इज द लास्ट थिंग दैट इज आर्टिकल द एंड विल हैव अ प्रैक्टिस सेशन ऑल्सो ओके टिल देन कीप लर्निंग बेटर थैंक यू वेरी मच